and there's a reason why we are here today. They saw lights and the teacher was gone. Yeah. There's a right. column getting ready to go over it. And it looks so this is gonna be crazy. Whoa, wait, guys, that cloud's gone. Oh my God. What just happened? Did you see that? Okay guys, we have been climbing. We climbed up yes. this mountain here. Um, we and just, we're trying to get up there on that mountain. Yeah, we just wanted to update you guys because you guys know we love hikes. Um, we've been going on this hike and so we got news. So. The reason we're going on this hike is because in this area where we are at, we have heard many stories over the years and lots of reports of some pretty strange things happening and so we wanted to come investigate it ourselves. Now we have to get yep. up there before the sun goes down. Yep, we can do um, it. This whole range here that you see, it's pretty bare because there, oh, we forgot to bring our reading stuff, our magnetic reader. The EMF flow reader? Yeah, Aww. we were gonna do some tests. Okay, let me fill you on, in on well, something. I think there's one thing that, from my perspective, for the story I'm gonna tell you, there's a reason why we're here today. That's in the shape of a heart. Sorry, that was really cool. That's kind of weird. You don't see that every day. Side note. Anyway, a lot of strange things happen. Well, we're taking a breather break. I'm just going to tell you one back from my childhood, boys. I haven't told you guys this, but I'm sure you have heard other stories from friends and probably even teachers of things that have happened around here. Um, I'm not sure if you guys are aware, but where we live, we're surrounded by mountains. Like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we're in a bowl. Basically, it's yeah. a bull and mountains are around us. So a lot of things happen here. Really crazy things. People will see lights. There's been disappearances, weird sounds. Um, people have other stories. But anyway, the story I'm going to tell you guys is um, back when I was in school many, many, many years ago. Okay, so these stories have been going on for hundreds of years. And this is something that happened. There was a teacher who was beloved by everybody back then. And everybody wanted to be in this teacher's class. And in Anyway, this teacher just went missing, okay? This teacher just went missing, okay? This teacher just went missing, okay? And there are a lot of rumors to, as to what happened to this teacher and where he could have gone. A person saw him headed up in this area and another person, you know, that was in the group with him said that they heard sounds, they saw lights, and the teacher was gone. Gone. On a field trip, gone. So I don't know what happened. They like everybody searched the area, can't find the person. There's no trace. And in, in today's world, you can find anybody, locate anybody. So that was really strange that they couldn't locate anything. And this is yeah. like, this has been talking for, I mean, long, many years. And a lot yeah. of strange things like this happen. So we're gonna investigate it today. We're gonna find out some of the mysteries of this area that we live in and find out what's going on. Yeah, and just hike it more. You guys know we love hiking. I mean, we are the adventurers. And so we've hiked like around this area so many times, but we have never hiked up to this top of this hill. And I don't know, just from like the start of this hike, things seem like weird. It's so that's why we wanna pull out the camera and just, just in case. We're gonna record know. and also, just record our, it's very steep. <laughs> it's We're very gonna record steep. our investigation because as you know, I like investigating things. Yeah. Yeah. But <laughs> we're gonna record it so that we have proof because we want some proof of whatever evidence we find. We're gonna look for any signs on the ground, any signs in the sky because the usually records. these all happen after dark. Yeah. Okay, so. And, and there's a reason why we are here today because today is the 150th anniversary of when what the article calls the incident happened. Something happened up here at the top or close to the top Very or somewhere sus. around this area. Well, that's why the teacher went up 150 there. years ago. It could be why the teacher went up there to go. Maybe, maybe he was there on the maybe the he was there on the 100 year anniversary because maybe. didn't the teacher disappear? It was a long about 50 years ago long or so. Time ago. These are rumors that went around my school. Maybe way 100 back. years ago. Yeah. Very but something, long time ago. according to the article that I was reading, on the anniversary every so many years, which I think is going to be the 150th year, which is this year that the return is supposed to happen. So I don't know what the the incident was, and I'm not exactly and sure what the return the is. Night. Tonight yeah. is the it's night. It's getting, okay, on camera it looks really bright, but I don't know if you can tell the sun is kind of setting. I mean. We got about 20 minutes Yeah, I was gonna dark. say. I Wait, what time is it? It's like, it is kind yeah. Of cool. So we are, I is guess, it, just give you a viewpoint. Like, we're yeah. pretty high. 
why. Jake, do you know what time it is? No. I know it's, it's I mean, we already ate. Eight. It's 8.26 yeah. actually. Yeah. So sun goes down in like, 15 minutes. 15 minutes. Yep, so we gotta, so, go. We gotta so, go hiking, guys. I don't know. I couldn't find a whole lot on the incident because we hurried up and came up here. Yeah. But this something was big happened. The moment, but yeah, I was gonna big, say, this was, like, this was like a really fast um, decision because I literally came in these shoes. Are you kidding me? Little sandals, and we're going up this like very steep hill. And so, <laughs> I don't know. This yeah. is very, like, I'm, yeah, very smart. I am surprised oh, yeah, there's not make more it. people up here. Okay, tell to me go the find out what the story. return is all about. Yeah, let's start walking, guys. Well, so yeah. the incident, so we can't, we can't keep staying in the same spot, or else yes. we're never gonna. Well, get obviously, there 150 dark. years ago, there wasn't all the technology and everything, and so this is like handwritten on on different types of paper. I could hardly read it. I was going through some microfiche. Uh, like they had pictures of the incident. Well, yes, what? kind of. What do you mean? Because remember, pictures back then were like horrible. They had no HD, they had no, they had nothing. It was very grainy, it was hard to see, but it looked like something had destroyed this area that we're going to, or something had landed. But 150 years ago, there were no spaceships, there were no airplanes, there were no rockets. Yeah, so like something fell from the sky is what the article was talking about when it talked about the incident. So I'm, I don't know. a shooting star. And they said they, we're told, and I don't know who they are because the article didn't go into a lot of detail, that they had to keep it a secret. They couldn't give a lot of details, but the return was going to happen in 150 years from that night. Maybe I'm the only one who found this article. I don't know. But all I can tell you is if it does return tonight, whatever it is, it's going to be awesome. And we're going to catch it on camera and you guys are going to see it. We'll have proof for And we will have proof. We will show you everything we that we find. It to the world. All the clues, all the... All the items. If something, look at the cloud. The cloud above that hill is a different color than the clouds yeah, it out looks around. Looks like they're starting to form around yeah, that. It's almost down like all yeah. there's a column getting ready to go over it. And it looks so this is gonna like be crazy. Clouds. That's it's where we're spooky. headed. This we're headed to the top. We're to the top of that mountain we're where make the it. funnel cloud is starting to. And we're in Utah. There are that no tornadoes, yeah. so there shouldn't be a funnel cloud. That almost looks like a volcano. That there are no does. volcanoes here either. That is odd. It's so strange. the return. Is going to be interesting. Yeah. Jordan, and then yeah. we want to hear what your stories are. If you've heard things from friends, I've heard some stuff. But yeah, I think we. From school. I think we need to start climbing. But because what I'm curious is, is have the rumors changed over the years from like when I went to school to when my kids now went to school? Yeah. I know I've they're still going stuff. around though. Okay. Yeah. I wonder if that teacher found something and around the incident. I wonder that too. Made because that that's weird. That is so weird. If we disappear, remember Guys, us. If you find this camera, make sure the world gets it. Okay, guys. We've been hiking more. Something weird just happened. This is weird. This what is, is going on with this beetle? This bug is Wait, upside just, don't, down. Don't, don't. No, look. Look. There's an no, ant colony here. It's upside down. And then this beetle was crawling along. He stopped, got up on his head. We don't know why. He's doing a handstand. That bug is upside down. But all these ants is, are hanging out over here. here. Yeah, do you see how it's literally like... Yeah, that's so weird. Like its legs are... It was just walking. That was, <laughs> yeah, that was just weird because we were hiking. I was like, oh my gosh. I've never seen a beetle do that before. So, kind of strange. Well, there were some oh, weird there's noises. A, there's a little like, caterpillar. Why, why is everything going away from the top of the mountain? Yeah, they're all headed... Everything's heading down. away. Yeah, they're all making their way hey. down the mountain. Right. It's just kind of weird. I, I wish know, you would have brought your tools so that we could I wish test. we had to. There's yeah. We oh. might have to come back, guys, and figure out what the readings are up here. I wish we had that. Today yeah. would have been the best day to get readings. <sighs> yeah, we're going to have to I come mean, back. this is the day. Like, if anything's going to happen, EMF, it's today. The infrared, Everything. the thermal. All the tools. Oh, I'm so, like... Guys, the clouds look like they're getting darker, I'm just they saying. Are. Something's going to happen. And look at that happen. cloud right there. It's, like, dissipating. Do you see how it's like dragged down over there? I am convinced. Like it looks like it, tell, it looks like it's, it's being like... it looks like it's being dragged either over here or like down. I can't really tell which way. And that cloud looks strange because all the others are like bubbles and like fluffy, but that one's just like boom. So since we've been hiking a little bit, boys, I'm just wondering if you've heard anything at school. I haven't really heard anything. Any rumors? You had your friends don't talk about this stuff. No. <laughs> no. Your friends don't. That's very interesting because you know. 
My guess is, is if you're not hearing it, then there's a generation that is trying to make this go away and doesn't want people to talk say, about it. I've heard a little bit about it, but I haven't heard about any of the stuff that you guys talked about until you told me. Um, but I've heard a few things from my friends that I'll like tell you guys in a, like once we get up there. I just wanna make sure we get up there before it's dark, so that way we have enough time. But yeah, I've heard a few things, so I don't that know. That is crazy, because- it's really strange. What's really interesting is like, it was well known when we lived here, and then we moved away, and when we came back, it's like, I mean, you still hear rumors trickle in, but, and this was well-known stuff when I was young. Okay. What do you hear that? <gasps> do you hear the cord? Guys, it's I do buzzing. hear it. I think it's the power cord. That is freaking scary. This is really scary. I don't know if that's like, wait, I mean, it's coming from like, I don't think you can one of these up the there. I don't think I can either. It's like, it's like, <laughs> that's really creepy. I don't know, I can hear the power literally like, running through that and I've, <laughs> I haven't heard on any of the other power lines so that's really kind of creepy. Oh, that is weird. I was up here two days ago scoping this area out Whoa. and this was not here before. Check this out. Something oh has God. happened oh, that's preventing again. us from being able to get to the top. Look at this. This was not here. This is not a public trail. $800 fine. I walked up that a couple days ago. This barbed wire fence was not no, here. None was of this was not. here. You could walk right up, but look, people have walked up it. Yeah. Now this is here on the night of the anniversary. Yeah. That is. Who's keeping us from here? Guys, who's watching? Who's us? up there? Somebody's up there. That cloud you see is getting different colors. That cloud is getting. Oh my goodness. Should there we just sit be... here and wait for? Well, the we dark? can't go up because they probably have cameras on us. Yeah. Yeah, we can't go any yeah. further. Who and wants well, that? Close. Is totally sus. That, that was, was not there. Not... Look at that poster. That is handmade. That's like, handwritten. Yeah. That is like making me wonder is there somebody on that trail over there watching us? There is. Or is there somebody up there watching us? Yeah. Is there well, a camera on this pole? Well, regardless, we can't go any further because it's private property, so we can't. No, trespass. we are not going up there. I don't yeah, really we have to pay turn back. Dollar fine. But you know what? We can still witness whatever is happening unless it's covered in the clouds. I was gonna say we could stay down here and we watch. We can just probably. see if, any, if we hear anything or see anything. If somebody comes running down, we can uh, be the first witnesses. Yeah, yeah, I'm just looking up at the clouds. I was gonna like, say it's weird how it's like a bowl. Yeah, well, and it's yeah, totally different. Look, strange. those clouds not even close to the darkness of this cloud. Something's happening yeah. up there on this hill. It's this specific. Like this whole region has stories, but this is very very highly like sus like sus yeah <laughs> like i don't know like there's just a lot more stories that involve this area guys Wait, do you hear that there's a motor why is there guys they do have patrols out do you hear that i heard <gasps> that i just heard oh that. right down there somebody is on the motorcycle yeah. yes right down there what are they as if i could hear stuff maybe it there's another way like around government who do you think that is there's another trail right over there that goes up this hill maybe they're going up the back way okay so they're, they're oh, patrolling they're, oh my goodness there's there they are patrolling. right there, there. Wait, there's, there's so many. many. They're, they're watching there? us. Three. There's three. Oh, guys, I don't they're sitting guys, there. Guys, pointing up at the mountain. They're pointing oh, no. up at the mountain. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's go let's down this Okay, let's, let's go hide over yeah, here. Yeah, because we're not, I don't want to go past We didn't go past area. their no. all no, of a sudden man-made fence. But that's a little suspicious. Let's say we go down this way and just watch what happens. Jordan, look. The tower. That wasn't there either. Oh my gosh, yeah. Guys, look. There's a tower over there. Whoa. That wasn't there either. Is that like a radio tower? Do that looks signals? like it. Let's go check that Wait, out. Wait, what if that's the sound? What if they're sending <gasps> out communications? Oh my goodness. Okay, what would they be communicating? Who would they be communicating to? What's this? Well, what is it? It looks Why like a tower. Why is it causing, oh, maybe it's you, causing this. What? This is a strange rock. What? What is it? That is not oh my a gosh, rock. That is what, is that? what is that? It's a broken off fragment. Take that of as evidence. It almost looks like a that's, Yeah, that's a fragment of something. That's oh my obsidian. gosh, okay. So that's not a bottle either. We that's need to polish thick. this up. This is that's so been made weird. By something. That's what broken that? off of a craft or something. Mm. That is so weird. Okay, hey, we're going to polish this up. 150 years ago, the arrival. Good job, Jake. Something Did crashed. Good job. That was crazy. Something happened. You might have just found this an ancient so artifact. Do you notice found... earlier there's like that little mound there? Should we investigate that mound? Yeah. Let's go look over there. I don't know what if is we going can on get with to this? that tower. Guys, there's another picture here. Oh my gosh. That wasn't there. I just that walked past there. it. I know. That was not I there. <laughs> How did you hey, okay, pick what it in up. the world? We're going to collect all these um, evidences. This is really weird. That piece that Katie just picked up was not it's there. Not there. Things were happening well, that wasn't even in real buried. time. Wait. Okay, let's look at this real fast. <laughs> this look, okay, this is, this is rock. This wasn't created. 
That's rock. I still think something's going on with that tower. That tower might be an amplifier for whatever's causing that cloud to go over that mountain. Do you see this pyramid coming up over that mountain there? I wonder if that's something. Do you see how it's like <gasps> this pyramid? Like on the horizon? Yeah, the... that could be like triangulation. I wonder if, Dude, oh my goodness. This is so weird. Okay, we gotta come up with like a backup plan in case something <laughs> really crazy happens. The sun is getting happens. really like dark and like red. Over there, yeah. the sun is setting. It's hard to tell on camera, but it's it getting is really getting red. Yeah. Guys, what is our plan if something starts happening or if know. people come up here? I don't know, this is so strange. What's our story? Guys, we gotta come up with a story. Here, I'm gonna turn the camera we're off. We're lost, that's Let's... always a good one. Oh, that's a good one. We're just lost. Yeah. I mean, we're doing nothing wrong. We're just sitting here just watching. Yeah, but we, they we, obviously somehow. don't want us up here. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Okay guys, it's getting quite active up here now. I don't know if you guys know, but there are quite a few people up here and I don't know if they're, what they're doing up here. It's they really strange. asking us questions like, what are we doing? We didn't really tell them anything. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. There's um, like four or five of these guys. Turn yeah, the camera as soon as they get ready to crazy. start going back down. Yes, so I don't know, I don't know like, So there was two people on motorcycles. Yeah. And then this other buggy, dune buggy type thing. Literally. Two guys and then a guy on a motorcycle and then another guy on a motorcycle. I wonder if they were coming up to find us for going past, the, if, if we would have gone past. because They're just like, past. what are you doing up yeah, here? We we're like, um, just, yeah, we're like, uh, we've just sitting here. We've never seen you guys, we've never seen yeah, you guys we're just here sitting before. Here. Why are you up here? Like, we're like, uh, whoa, wait, guys, that cloud's gone. Oh my God. What? I just noticed it, where'd it go? What? Do you remember that big, huge cloud that was there? Yeah. Gone now. Whoa, we were distracted talking yeah. to them, and that now is gone. And it was the sitting there the, and it has forever. Been Where could it have gone? Here's a question. Was it really a cloud? Well, that's what I think. I don't think it was a cloud. Because all these other clouds are still here. Yeah, right? It looked right? like a cloud, but maybe that was a, a, some sort of, a, I don't know. I don't even know if I want to say it yet. I don't want to jinx this. I'm <laughs> getting a little crazy. Oh, it's getting nervous. Okay, I wanted to share my story. Hold on, I don't want to drop this camera. Everybody else is looking over there and investigating. And I figured I would just fill you guys in on what my story was while they're looking around and while we're waiting for it to kind of get darker and just like seeing what's going on. So basically, um, I've just heard a few like rumors from some of my friends. They've hiked over here. And I mean, that like trespass sign wasn't there before. It is like recent, like it just barely got posted because like my dad said, like it wasn't there a few days ago. And so, I mean, they hiked up there when there wasn't a trespass sign. They said it was nighttime and I don't remember exactly. They saw like some sort of light or something. And I was like, well, it was a shooting star. And they were saying, it's not like a shooting star. It was kind of like a, like a fireball, but kind of not. It just looked very like, outer worldly and kind of I don't know how to explain it um, I don't know it's just kind of strange and I don't know I've heard some other stories about like them like hearing strange sounds and they just said it's spooky you found something Guys, come on! Grab the camera. Let's go. You're gonna be first. Let's go figure out. Oh my goodness, guys! I hope that got on camera. Did you see that? That was insane. I swear that was kind of like what my friends were talking about. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Did you see that? I'm so glad we got that on camera. What was that? What was that? That was. I don't know, but it's not even that dark yet. I mean, it's I've getting dark, but it's not like anything like that before. Hey, let's proceed with caution because that was huge. That was huge. That was really, really crazy. Was Boys, that, like, wait, wait, listen, listen. Was that a crash? What was that? Do you guys hear like big machinery? I do hear something. I'm hearing the motorcycles again. I hear motorcycles. Something's going on over this hill. I hear machinery. I hear you. Um, I hear you. The cloud again is like dragged down right there on the opposite side. Okay, the clouds are being really weird. Be careful. What do you think that was though? Was that like. Maybe I it was mean, a meteor. A meteor a strike. Meteor? A we crash? had a meteor strike. 
Do you think but, like something? Guys, happened? I didn't. Okay, I don't how know. How can it be coincidental on the 150th yeah, anniversary? Something. What did you find? Oh, you're just hanging yeah, your shoes. Something happened shoe. above there. You know what? Okay, here. I'm, here's my conspiracy yet. theory. My conspiracy theory is, is something happened on the top of that hill with that. We're gonna call it a cloud, but I think it was really like a force field or some sort of a shapeshifter thing. Something happened up there. The communicating device that we found that was down over there did something and something just fell from the sky. Something fell. I don't know if it was a meteor. I don't know what was that. I don't know if it was a satellite. I don't know if it was something from another galaxy, but we're gonna go find out. Nice. They're, but they're something's spooky. going on. It's almost something's like- Something's rolling in down there. There are a whole bunch of big trucks just came up that road. Cause we can't go down there. Okay, let's let's kind of take. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I don't think we're, we're stuck up here though, because that's where we parked our vehicle was down there. Oh, okay, are you okay, Ty? Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay, okay. Guys, 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 let's actually go like slowly and carefully. This is like kind of spooky now. Guys, we're not supposed. That's to be really here. weird. I mean, if we saw something that we weren't supposed to see, this isn't good. Okay, remember in the movie Men in Black, they come up to you and they have the, like this little thing and they go, and they erase all your memories. If somebody comes up, whoa, what's wrong with the flashlight? It's like, <laughs> what just happened? It's not working, bro. I turned it off. I turned it off because it was like dying. These are brand new batteries. Anyway, if somebody comes up to us and starts asking questions, guys, we gotta don't hide answer the camera. Just yeah, I was gonna camera. say, because be they'll, witnesses. yeah, otherwise they'll delete the footage. So okay, if we down. post this, what's gonna happen to mm -hmm. us? I don't know. I don't know what we're gonna find. Let's what get up to the edge of this hill into? and see what's down there. Guys, comment down below what you think it was because um, we need some more, like, I don't know, just advice and input on what you guys think. Um, because I want I'm to spooked. break out the truth. I want to get to the bottom of this, but we have to do it smart. I yeah, hear, me too. I, I agree. Don't hear. I smart, see safe, and cautious. Conspiracy theory happening. There's going to be a cover up. But Nobody's going to say they yeah, saw right? anything, but you guys saw it. We saw it. We rerounded yeah, the film make it and seem we saw conspiracy, it. It's conspiracy, but it's not. It's truth. Yeah. We're going to document every single piece so you guys, guys can be part of this as well. I'm carrying these back. I've still got them. We're going to carry back these frames. Yeah, we need to wash those We're and gonna see. Out what's going on with them? Because I don't know where that's from. Like, I literally, like, I would have no idea. That looks really, Wait. really strange. Because I just heard voices. Ty, come back here. Ty. There's literally no place to hide. I know. We're literally, like, <laughs> kind of in a field right now. <laughs> I don't know where to go. I don't know where to go either. We gotta get to the crest of this hill. I think if we can go down there and see mm -hmm. maybe what's going on, but don't walk past the crest. Stay behind the ridge line. Guys, I don't wanna like, I'm like scared to like. I'm worried we're gonna get caught and then I don't know what will happen. Like, well, literally, whoever's behind us, where are they gonna take us? What are they gonna do? I was gonna say, literally all we've done is we just got on the hike and we've just been watching yeah, things. And like, we haven't done anything wrong. There was no, but we like, saw stuff. But yeah, that's the thing is that we've seen stuff. And so people might like, I don't know. I'm just really nervous that they might try and like, I don't know. Let's just take it one step at a time, low and slow. Guys, there's people coming up that road. There is a whole That is an abandoned farm road. Nobody goes on that road. That's literally a motorcycle. Look, bigger vehicles coming up that way. I've never seen vehicles on yeah. that road. Guys, I've noticed a pattern that literally it's all like motorcycles and like um four wheelers and like what are the other ones? ATVs, is that what it is? Yeah, ATVs? I feel like we should like, like those sort of like, like cars. Wait, do you like, see that one with the yellow lights yeah. that's just sitting there? Oh my yeah. goodness. Yeah, it's not moving. Yeah, that one is literally like a four-wheeler. That's a four-wheeler, oh. guys. Oh, it's flashing. It literally is flashing. flashing. There's that one right there. Oh Whoa. My oh. Okay. Oh, yeah, they probably spotted us. Guys, we need to get off of here. Look, down here. We need to get Those off of here. Those trucks weren't there before. I want to find out what's going on, though. Check this out. We're just coming up over the ridge here. That's what that noise was. There was not. How did they get there? The landscape yeah. has changed. This is crazy. What? Check this out. I don't know if you can see it. It's like a crater. Look. Oh my goodness. Okay, what something dented the earth there. That was not all dug out before. What is that's where the, That's where whatever came from the sky crashed. Should we go down there? Should we go down and see if we can yes. find out any evidence? Boys, boys, should guys, we go down our there? Our vehicle's down there. Yeah. Not Somewhere right down there. there, though. No, it's kind We're of further like, down up over that yeah. way. But we gotta go down there. I don't know. What do you guys Jake, think? Do you want to take I don't lead? know. Our vehicle's that way, but we have to go down that way to get to our vehicle. Ty? That's there, and that There's used nothing. to be a normal hill. I don't want to go. That's dented. I'm good. I want to go. I want to find out what's going oh. on. Okay. 
Okay, something. I don't want to go by myself. Look, it's spooky. We have to stick together. We can't separate. Okay, let's go. Okay. Low and slow, guys. Everybody oh, stay together. Tie vehicles stay still there monitoring. <gasps> Oh I can hear those vehicles. Guys, they're getting That's closer. They're coming. That's actually us. so loud. Oh my gosh, they're coming down that road. Do you see the lights? They are. Yeah. They're coming. Wait, literally, nice. watch, watch, watch. They're, they're about to go through. That side? Oh my gosh, what is with the blue and red lights? That is a. <gasps> Did you Dude, that see that? That's like a police or some sort of a government vehicle. And that one's still stuck there. And that one's still sitting it's there. Not with moving. his turn signal on. Okay, stuff is going on right over there. in this area. All right, we'll see if we can zoom in closer, but it's like right there by my finger. That vehicle's just sitting there watching us. Guys, I want to go find out what was, because we heard noises. I think they got in there and they tried to cover up How something. How did they hear so fast? I don't know. That's like, and yeah. How did they dig it out? Like, it dig How? Them? How so yeah, fast? Like, yeah, and how they, like, well, well I think did whatever they dig crashed that out? There, did something dug it crash out? and dent? I think they took whatever landed there. That was there's fast. still a truck down there. I f say we go see if there's any licenses on the truck, any labels on the truck, yeah. and we will track this and find the truth. I think we should too, but we should also start hurrying because it's getting dark and also it's getting really cold. Okay, guys, we're a lot closer oh to we're gonna call it the zone. We gotta get Look, down to that truck. That vehicle is now on its way to see yeah, us. Yeah, literally. And there's one coming up. Two, two coming oh up behind gosh, it. We gotta get there first. What if they're trying to remove every bit of evidence? Okay, let's go. Oh my goodness. Yeah, oh, go. He's right Hurry. there. It's come coming on the bend. Go. Careful, it's steep. Careful, careful, careful. careful. <laughs> the family is going down that road. That's up where I parked our vehicle. But check this out. I'm coming up on the crash site. This fence was not here, and there's a sign. I can't read it. It looks like everybody just left the crash site. It has been about 30 minutes. We were just kind of sitting over here waiting, but I am intrigued to find out what this signpost says. This wasn't here before. Here we go. Shh. What? Danger. What is going on? This used to look like this. It was just all like Healy. Vehicles in here? Something was taken from here. Guys, I gotta get back with the family. There's a conspiracy being brewed right now. I can tell you right now, something landed here. The government or somebody came here, took whatever landed, and now they're making it look like something, a big cover up. I gotta go find the family. Hey guys, so. Ty, where are we? we? Yeah, where are we, Ty? We're in the crater, like right by us. You can see all the, I don't know if you can see it on camera, but all the track marks from the, the from People, the vehicles. Yes. Look, they're piling things up. This was all a tree. Now the roots are all hanging out. There was a tree yeah. here. There was a hill. It was just normal. This is all a big this hill right here. Yeah. This, this is, so is really, really crazy. Because we should search for any scraps. Like the stuff that we found yes, up at the top right? of the hill. Let's yeah. see if we can find anything yeah, else down here. I keep seeing sparkly stuff in the dirt too. Like, I don't know. There was some pieces over here that like were, Sparkly, it looked like I don't know if it was like fragments of something or I don't well, know something I say, like it doesn't matter how small it rocks is, let's or, collect it. Yeah, you know what? We should probably do you think, think, it again. It's like do you think we could take a light. sample of the soil and test it? Oh, that'd, what if be it's really like that'd be really good, that'd be really good. Magnetic yeah. or like what if there's some properties in the soil that they missed and we could collect? I didn't bring anything, should I just take a handful of it? I think we should take some dirt. But what if it's radioactive? I know, right? <laughs> you know what? Maybe we come back with let's a bottle when we come back with the other testers. Let's do that. Okay, we I don't want to hold back it. and collect the soil and find out what's going on. Dad, I found something. What? What? Right there, look. What is it, Ty? What is that? Whoa. What is that? Wait, there's a green thing. Oh, no, it's this. What? what? Whoa. How'd you oh. see that? Grab it. Can you grab it? It was different. Okay, get it. Yeah, yeah. What is that? I'm afraid to touch it. Oh, it's so dusty. Here, it's a box. Is there writing on it? Uh, that looks you know, really suspicious. I say we take it. Should take we take it? it? Yeah, I think we just keep it and just see what it is. Us? I don't know. Okay. What's that green thing? We should also look yeah, at I'm that. Just yeah, set I think, this can down. we get that green can, thing? I'll try to get it. It would probably be good to test it all. It looks like something like fell here and like stuff is shattered to pieces and like, cause I mean there was like sparkly like fragments. It looked like something broke. Obviously there's stuff here. Something's we going on. We need to on. test okay. this soil. Yeah. I think that we need to get back here and test this soil, okay. like probably tomorrow, guys. Well, there's some this. soil on this. We can there's test like, this. There's like marks on it. There's like engravings. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're definitely taking this. this Let's keep crazy. going. Yes. Something weird tree that looks like 
Okay. I don't think go. we're alone out here. Yeah, I'm... Mm. I think we should go. It's I feel getting like a little we should too go. real. I don't want to be caught holding this. You know, I think should we, we need come to get out of here. tomorrow in the daylight beetle? and look for more evidence and get oh, more dirt like sample? Is that gold? Wait, is that a is gold it? nugget? Oh, what is that right there? Right here. We should probably clean this up. Right there? There's another one right here. What's this writing? This looks really weird. Guys, I feel like we need to get out of here. It's kind of heavy. I say we come back later. I say we come back later too yeah. when it's light. There outside. is something over there. I don't know if that's a guard dog or what. Let's keep going. Oh my goodness. Let's go. Where's they got people? It might not be here later though. It could be patrolling. We've got to get in our vehicle. Jake, come we on. We may have to I camp out. Found then we may. Oh, guys, we found more. Guys, guys, they're finding stuff everywhere. Collect it, guys. Okay, we gotta come back. Collect it. Let's yeah, let's, let's go home. Get our. No, guys, just get in the vehicle. We could camp. I don't know what this is, but some part of some something. Collect it. Dude, if we leave. I don't know what this is. We have to. If we leave, they're gonna take everything. We're gonna have to take the chance of leaving, getting some equipment. Do you think we can get our vehicle back. out they're of here? I don't know. When we come back, it's all between between we're us, camping in the, we're gonna be camping. Our vehicle's that way. We gotta go that way. And they're down that and there's way. There's something down and that I way. I hear something. Should we hike back? Yeah, well. Leave the vehicle and just hike back home? But, I don't and know. And then they know where we are. I was gonna we say, I feel like no. we should just drive we back get right the now. We I think I think oh. if we come early enough in the morning tomorrow, I think we could still get stuff. We just gotta go. Yeah, because we don't have if all the stuff. Like we need to early have stuff. And do it before anybody else can get here because yeah. Well, they might clear it. Well, we need to have like like we don't even have the so equipment. For yeah, this. but they might take even more stuff at nighttime before anyone notices that they're there. Okay, let's okay. get home. Let's take a closer look at this. Let's go. Know. We're gonna get caught. Let's yeah, go. Yeah, we got kind of nervous. Let's go. Okay, guys, we're making our way getaway, and we kind of just got down to a point. We've been being followed, and we have to get out of here. But we wanted to show you something real quick, because if you look right here, I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if you can see it. Check That's out. the rear view of my Check car. Yeah, go out and show them. That was not there when we came up this road. Okay, guys, I'm gonna do this real quick. Okay, this says I have to hurry though. Road closed. Okay. I have to hurry because they were following us. And okay, we could go. Go, go, go. Okay. We were fo being followed and uh, that wasn't there. So they came and placed that after we arrived here and put road closed. I just hope they're not tracking us with drones or anything. Yeah. This is scary. I think we need to get these this evidence back to a safe place and get home. Okay guys, we made it back home. I don't think we were followed, but we want to hurry and quickly look at these um, evidences before we lock them away. So, first of all, we found these shards. Yeah, they're kind of shiny. They reflect the light, but it's very dirty. We're gonna need to wash them. Yeah. So also, what do you think I, it might be though? I wonder if these go together. Oh, oh it looks like it does. Wow. Oh, that was a good fit, Jake. Yeah. Wait, did you know those went together like that? No, oh not, not until I just tried. I'm just saying, this looks like it's broken off pieces. I mean, like, like a lot of these things look like it's like something like, I don't know, maybe crashed and like pieces have blown off. That's what it looks like to me. Cause I don't know what else Yours this is could like be at all. Metal. Yeah, like I have yeah. no idea what else this could be literally at all. I think um, this is just garbage that we found, but we can still keep that as evidence. Yeah. yeah. Maybe until we get I don't think we should get rid of anything right now because I don't know. I just I don't know, and yeah, I don't think this either. is really weird. This is the coloring on this metal. It's yeah. like gold, but it's silver. I don't know how to explain it. It's like silvery and gold, depending on like kind of the light. It's oh, really it's really weird. weird. It's full of like really dirt. dirty. But we're gonna go collect more dirt. Yeah, so that we have enough to run Whoa. the test. There's a button right here. Wait, where? Did you just push a button? Yeah. Don't push Did you do anything? Don't push buttons. Wait. <gasps> Maybe. I don't know what it does. There was a little button. Wait. Oh, it weird. just pushes this down, but I don't know what that connects what to. What do you think it went to? Is. I have no idea, but it, so like, this is like really busted. So kind of a locking busted. mag... Mm, mechanism or something? Huh. Something. I don't know, I have no idea what this is, but it's like, it's totally busted off of something. So like, yeah. these are all broken pieces of something. Yeah. And then this, this is the last thing that Ty found, sticking mm -hmm. out of the dirt. So this is really weird, because if you touch it, it feels like, it feels a weird texture, mm -hmm. but there's like raised up things. Ooh, there's like a spider web right there. I don't even know how to yeah, describe it. Yeah, and it's it. different on all sides and all angles. Like, so, is there something inside of it? There's different writings over here. There's something, it's kind of heavy. It, it's heavier than you would think it is. But look, there's all these different symbols. Like some of them are in a gold writing. 
Some of them are engraved into the actual piece, whatever this is. Look, they're all different. Like these all have different things. What None of them material? are the same. I have no idea. It's, I wonder it, if we it could feels, test it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're gonna have to do something because it feels totally. Because we could probably nick off a little weird. sample and try to do some testing on it, but I don't even know how to test it. We're gonna have to like research that. Yeah, how, yeah, do, how do you even open it? Yeah, how do you get what's inside if you know. can't open it? I don't even I know, know if there's something well, inside because it's heavy. We're gonna have to sit and look at that. It could just. Maybe these are bands. It, maybe these say, bands come off. It almost looks like it's protecting something on the inside. But we could probably maybe this oh, could be saying something. We could something. research this, but I don't even know how to put those symbols into the computer. Mm -mm. Like we don't have anything maybe we like that. Take pictures and send it to somebody. Maybe yeah. an This could be like. I don't know of any archaeologists. This could be maybe, words. It could be words. It could. It, it, these could be instructions. These could be clues. These could be riddles. These could be. We do need anything. those solid directions. Like they could that. be coordinates. I don't know. Maybe somebody up at the university can help us in the archaeology department. Yeah, this is really strange. That was really strange. Logan, what's it? What is it? What is it, Logan? I wasn't expecting anybody. Today we are going to do Yes Day for You. Hey buddy. So, yes, you are annoying in my ear. <laughs> So this is Yes Day for the fans. Now, I get to choose the first one um, of what we're going to do, and I've already chosen it, and so many of you wanted us to go for a walk and take the dogs for a walk and to go to, for a hike. And I feel yes. like those are kind of the same thing because when we hike, we take our dogs. Yes. So, so go for a walk. basically how this challenge works, you guys might have seen on my channel me having a Yes Day, and it basically means that whatever, like, the person wants to do, everybody has to say yes to it. So we went on Instagram on and posted on our story, the YouTube fam, if you wanna check it out, make sure to go follow us <laughs> for any future like video stuff. Um, but we went on our Instagram story and asked you guys what different things you want to see us do today and um, you guys delivered. So we are unfortunately not gonna be able to do everything but we're gonna scroll through randomly and we have to say yes to whatever we land on. So. Yep, so the first one is take the dogs for a walk or hike and why I chose this is because we need to go back and collect some soil sample from the crash site. Oh my goodness. Yes. You guys yes. remember the previous yeah. couple videos, there was a crash site. If you haven't watched yeah. that, you need to go back because we're headed back to the crash site. Hopefully, um, nobody is there. Hopefully, yeah. it's, a Hopefully it's early enough and we can collect the soil sample and maybe do a few readings yeah. while we're there. It's um, gonna be intense. So I have a feeling that we gotta get in there, stealth, yeah. And then be quiet and then get our readings, get our samples and get out. Okay, so I want to give a quick shout out to those that suggested this challenge. And then afterwards, after we collect our soil samples and do some readings, then each person in the family is going to then um, scroll through and just stop randomly and select something. I hope yep. I find one this for us is. to say yes to. Go get something to eat because it's almost dinner time. Okay. Yeah, for sure. Um, so we have, can you go for a walk? From JordanXN.edits. <laughs> Um, take the dogs for a walk. Aesthetic underscore X underscore just Jordan thir 33. <laughs> oh There's a lot of you that suggested this. Car underscore Hoot Houchin 725. Malek Mayer underscore T. Isabel dot Dawson. It's underscore Lace YOX. Um, My Myla underscore Johan <laughs> underscore. All right. Cosgrove Grain. Okay. Anna dot Casey. And one last one. Andrew underscore the singing underscore B A something. The elders and dot underscore dot fam. Yeah. Um, I mean, we may have missed some people too. There was a lot Audrey, of people that suggested. Let me but. see, just a couple more. Audrey underscore Jordy underscore number underscore one. Yeah, oh so God. thank you for yes. your suggestions. There's everybody. probably more. So that's what we're headed off to do. That YouTube family style. Here we go. Okay, we are out in a very beautiful area. We're going to take the dogs for a walk. We're going for a hike. And, nice. um, and then after, we're going to go check out that site. Yes. What? What do you spider. see here? It's a floating oh. spider. He's right here. He's, he's floating in the wind. I can't get closer. I don't know if you can see it. It's all over. It probably can't be seen. It's a yeah, gray so we're on, we're on yeah. a really good trail that, like, I, know, right? I mean, it's... We're by ourselves. Yeah, we're by ourselves. So we're able to let the dogs off the leash so they can go and, like, explore and stuff some more, which is yeah. so fun. Our We're dogs are pretty fun. good off the leash. They yeah. come back to us when we call them, so. Yeah, we've trained them to be pretty good with that. Yeah. So we're gonna go walk yeah. the dogs, which we've, so honestly. <laughs> we've been walking and hiking for quite some time yeah. now. <laughs> um, but we'll keep continuing up the trail a little bit and then yeah. we're gonna get to the site because we drove by the site and I have to tell you, there was it's some different. strange people there and things have changed. It's very yeah, different. There's been movement. Wait till you guys see it. I'm it doesn't look the, the same. Stuff we did. 
because today the, they've no shoveled, they've moved yeah. stuff. They've brought stuff in. They're trying to cover it up. They are. They covered it's it. They moved dirt piles. Those those that mound of branches is moved. We'll show you. Yeah. But let's go walk the dog. All the people who suggested this, thank you so much. This has been such a fun like little hike and everything. And the dogs have really enjoyed it as well. And he's sitting he's and drinking. some water. <laughs> you can give him some more water. That's funny. <laughs> That's so cute. We're gonna keep going. We're still walking, guys. I know it's not a long time for you, but I want to show you Logan's little paws if I can catch up to him. Uh, he's very dirty. Come here, Logan. Come here. Come Just proof of how long we have show, walked. Show everybody how dirty Look you at are. his dirty little feet. That's how far we've walked. <laughs> he's a dirty guy. He is so dirty. Can I show? You want to show your paws? Atlas doesn't get dirty. Yeah, no. Atlas doesn't get nearly as dirty. I do have to say, I noticed as I was scrolling that somebody commented that we should give the puppies a bath. I agree. They're yeah. going to require a bath. Yeah. Whether we do it on camera or at the end of the day, at nighttime, it's gonna happen. It will happen yeah. regardless. And the dogs aren't Just happy that you commented hike. that because they hate baths. <laughs> they don't enjoy the baths, but if they get muddy yeah. like that, they do have to be washed off. Yeah, and it's been a while, anyways. Yeah, that they like, like they just need a week. bath. Yeah. So that's our walk. We've been walking quite a ways. It has been pretty good. I'm excited for the next person. Who's going to choose next? Who's wanting to choose next? I'll choose next. Okay, so David's gonna scroll through all your comments and choose our next activity. But first, we're gonna I'm go check going out. To. The site. Yes, we will check out the site. The one I'm not gonna pick that I saw that somebody said, and I sorry I can't remember, but you know who you are. You said to prank David. I'm not gonna pick that one. Sorry. <laughs> well, <I'll> pick that <laughs> one. Yeah, they'll just scroll randomly and choose something, and yeah, we won't get through them all because there was lots of you guys commented, which we're so grateful for. Thank you. That was very appreciative. It we makes it fun. Okay, guys, we just arrived at the site, and I want to kind of show you what it looks like. But we're going to be safe first. Um, I know we went into this site last night like kind of just like went in and did it but now we start thinking about it and we don't know like whatever landed here if there was like any radioactive qualities or anything that could give off because Jordan noticed that there was sparkle in the soil so we don't know if like it was given off something so we're going to have Jake suit up and go get some samples of the soil um, we're going to do this safely and he's also going to take some readings and then I don't know, maybe we'll, one of us will suit up as well and take the camera and follow him so you can see. Yeah, I'll suit up next time. So we've got, this detects uh, radiation. This is a thermal, uh, what is it, a thermal tester. So it'll tell you the temperature of things. And then this is an EMF meter. It tells us there's electromagnetic magnetic activity. activity. That's a, so, so, and then he's got the cup to put the, sample of dirt in yeah okay so jake's getting ready he's right here you nervous at all yes <laughs> do you feel like this will protect you enough i mean it covers like your feet you're fully covered you put your face shield on do you feel like you're protected i think so i think it, you'll be safe we all went into the area last night but we probably shouldn't have done it because we don't know what that will do to us should i put um, on my shoes with this um no you should be fine that's a you different you can probably just thicker. walk like that it should protect you okay, okay so there's oh, the sample okay, let me make sure everything is sealed so we, we're okay. good yeah check right. them and then we'll be right back because we got to get suited up so we can go in the site as My well it's up here so I gotta get and get it. okay guys we're approaching the site now david and i both suited up so we could help jake so he's not alone so we're just going to show you the site now as we come along this is the edge that we were inspected and we found the box and the green thing the items. now there used to be i swear it was about here a pile of branches yeah this area there were more defined tracks and now it's really padded down dirt it was not padded down like this before i feel like they might have dug back a little further i think what happened is they were coming along searching for that box oh, i'll touch the dirt <laughs> uh oh okay take a take a reading here do this take take the radiation reading okay and tell me if you see anything see the green light yeah it's like he's it's getting flashy. something there he's getting something wave it around different areas yeah it's beeping i don't know if you can hear that it's beeping yeah okay so okay. there's different levels of radiation why don't you do the next um tool and see if he's already got one tell us yeah. what temperature it is okay 
if know, there's any heat down. coming off of this we need to know about so it's a laser pointer it's giving you what, 50 degrees yeah 50 degrees can we go down Fahrenheit. to where we found the box because it was further down here because yeah, i yeah. just want to show as we go down i don't know was it around here there used to be like wasn't oh, there oh. some branches or something like i feel like it was this yeah. area is so it is it's all moved and this is much higher here take the emf reader tell us if there's any emf readings so this is your electromagnetic are you getting anything no i'm not getting much Okay, so right now that's looking pretty good. Yeah. Okay. We do need to find a spot to collect the soil from. What yeah. do you think we should collect the soil? I think we should collect it around there maybe. Around yeah, I feel like that area is the place where the box was as well. Yeah, like right here. Because I feel, and it feels like very, and this one doesn't feel compact. Like okay. what this is. Guys, before we do the next testing, I want to also show you. Show us how, show them how they're trying to cover it up. Like, show you this. This was not here. This mound of these rocks and boulders. What is this? And see, there's the branches. Those branches were up further along this crater. There's more. They've like dug out more. Yeah, there's more. This is so weird. I don't understand what this area is, what they're doing here. It looks like they're going to like replace all this dirt with rocks. It's weird. Yeah, I don't understand this. All right, guys, I've picked mine and there's some really cool ones. The family's super excited because we're going to Chick-fil-A. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> because there's so many of you guys that are like, oh, do Chick-fil-A. Somebody said breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Yes, yeah, somebody uh, said breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Um, T-Y-F-S dot loving. And yeah, then also. Also, by the way, we're in the drive-thru, so we're like just inching forward. Yeah, we're not driving moving. and vlogging. I hope you guys know we wouldn't do that. <laughs> and then TYFS Strong said have a mukbang. Oh, so um, yeah, that's the other thing we're gonna do. So we're gonna all get something from the Chick-fil-A menu and we all are gonna get something different. Yay! And then we're gonna do a little mukbang. Oh, yeah. And then I think there's one Try more that, um, uh, somebody said have it for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. We're going to do dinner oh. now. Oh, that was TOIF to stop loving. Okay, so yeah, so we're doing the Chick fil A. Whoever suggested going here, you guys know us. Again. Yes, I was gonna say, you guys you have literally us. planned like the perfect day for us <laughs> hiking, Chick fil A. Like, these are all things that oh, we yeah. love. Oh, yeah, somebody so said Chick fil A like, besties. Go it's to so the, nice. Yeah, there you so. Go. yeah, so I think it's been way fun so far. You guys have good taste. So we're gonna <laughs> order it and we'll be back for a little mukbang. But wait, 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 oh. but how we're gonna order is we're gonna order a whole bunch of random things on the menu yeah. and divide those up so that we try new things. So we're yeah. not just gonna order so we're gonna a try a new chicken sandwich <laughs> or a chicken sandwich yeah. or the original chicken sandwich. Spicy. But I have a feeling sandwich? it's gonna be a chicken sandwich. Mm -hmm. Should we order it one through six or one through five? One through five, yep. And just say that. we want one, two, three, four, and five, whatever those combos are. <laughs> okay, let's do it. And then Jeez. I want a shake. And then we'll just divide it at the end. Yeah. Perfect. We'll be back. Back home, we've got our Chick fil A. We're doing a mukbang. Chick fil A. Okay, <laughs> so we don't know exactly what we ordered. We ordered a number one, two, three, four, and five. And we told the guys not to tell us what they are. So all we know is that we have this. We just have. Well, I know what these are. These are chicken nuggets. Okay, so <laughs> everybody's gonna grab one or what? Yeah, everybody grab one. Actually, I'll grab one dinner. I, I don't I'll know what this. I want. Which one do you want, Mom? There's a anything not spicy. I can't open it. Oh, uh, that's a grilled sandwich. Oh, I want this one. <laughs> I think this that one's a spicy chicken sandwich because it's in, it says may like start this. mouth fires and I don't think Katie oh, will eat I this can, one. I wouldn't eat it. Ty, you sure you don't want the spicy chicken sandwich? And this sandwich? one, this sure. one's a normal like chicken sandwich. It's, it's, very, plain. Plain. <laughs> it's very, very plain, but I, I've had this before actually, it's really good. Mom, do you want this one or don't this one? I'll take the grilled. Okay, this one's like a fancy sandwich, it's got a very but fancy bun. instead of like a, like breaded, it's just like grilled. Okay. So, um, what do you want to talk about you real fast? just get um, chicken nuggets? I guess so. So is mukbang where we like chomp, chomp into the thing or do we just talk? Just talk. Okay, so you're not going to hear me go. We oh. didn't get straws, so oh. just do this. Oh. Oh. I thought we had straws. I was going to no ask you to go look for the straws. Yeah. Let's have the topic be summer fun. Yes. So what's your idea of doing something during the summer that's fun? Video games all day long. Oh. <laughs> of course. I... Um, I just want to go look camping a lot. <laughs> Atlas just took the box that had the drinks in it. Oh, he loves shredding those things. Okay, so camping. Mm -hmm. 
I want to go to a bunch of different places and just camp in our RV a bunch. Well, oh, wait. I know what you're doing. Hey. I know. Wow. I thought these were chicken nuggets, but they're ch chicken strips. There you go. <laughs> something new. See, we're all trying something new. Except Not for quite time. This <laughs> is really good. Yeah. I think mom's idea is even more hiking. I do like hiking. I agree. That's my I love hiking. Thing. What we'll do you say for you, though, Ty? What do you want to do this summer? Mm, go to a cabin. Oh, a cabin. We haven't done a cabin in so Since long. COVID started. Like Airbnb from before. Since COVID started, we didn't do any of the traveling. No, we stopped. Hey, Jake. Flying with cousins. Oh, yeah. <laughs> with cousins, that is very fun. What do you say? Well, we could take the trailer and go on a cousin tour Ooh. and go visit all of our cousins. That way it gets Jake's out of the way, it gets Jordan's out of the way, and Ty well, could maybe watch they're, they're all our cousins, but are you saying like, Girl, your age, girls or boys? Yeah. I was gonna say, I mean, yeah, it's all of our cousins. cousins, cousins but... and, yeah. That way you get to see all your cousins, yeah. basically. He's just a violent girl boy. Yeah. Even though like you guys play with your boy cousins or even if you're a girl and if you're a boy, you play with your and girl cousins. And different ages, like, it doesn't matter, yeah. But still. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well mine's hiking. Okay, Jordan, you're gonna pull our next yes day one. Mm. Okay, Jordan, you have the next yes day okay. uh, thing that we're going to be doing. I was scrolling randomly. <laughs> I'm excited for this one. Um, the one that I found says, <laughs> smack your David's head. So, <laughs> smack Dad's head. What? Everybody this gets one? to play Dad's head like it's a drum. This one is from uh, <laughs> Teresa <laughs> Morose. I don't know if I, if I said your name right, but shout out to you. I thought that was a really funny one. That's one that I randomly landed on while scrolling, so. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Take it so I can do it. Yeah. Okay. Okay, your turn. Apparently everybody's got the same tune in their head. But it 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 one of our followers. Okay, one of them says, have a great day. It's oh. by Jess o o Carly. Jess o Carly. Carly. How do I say that? Nice. Okay. Just Jess of Carly. Oh, Jess, Jess of Carly. Carly. Yeah. Okay, yeah, are we having a great day, guys? Yeah. yeah. Great day, yep. great day. Yep. Got the okay. Chick-fil-A hikes, this is good. Uh, so are you having a great day? Yeah, yeah he's, he's having, having a great, great day. day. Okay, Ty, your turn. So a lot of you guys want us to eat pig's feet. And one of you guys want us to cook pig's feet. Oh my goodness. Oh. And we have to say yes. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, so this suggestion was from Aesthetic TYFS. Okay, so let's go get our bottle of pig's feet. Uh, I and think mom. I'll try oh. it. I'll try it. Maybe it's good, right? Okay, for those of you who do not know what we're talking about when we say pig's feet, because there's different kinds. This is pickled pig's feet by Hormel. You can get it on the top shelf at Walmart and it's a top shelf. Um, I just wanted to show you this. This is like our punishment in a lot of our videos. It's gelatinous. It's very vinegary. There's like this fatty stuff that comes off of it. So what we're going to do is we're going to dump some of this fatty stuff in the sink. I may even rinse a piece of the chicken a little bit. And then, just, and not the chicken, the pig's feet. Get it with it, because it'll just boil off. You think so? Yeah, it'll turn liquid when it gets. I want to get like a whole feet or foot out. Oh. It's uh, really blubbery. It's really nasty. Oh. Ew, I don't know if you can see this, but look at this blob of like. Jeez. It's just fat. It's, like it's gross. It's vinegar. It's fat. I'm gonna rinse. Just give it a quick little rinse. So we have like a good chunk of it. Why are you touching okay. that with your Literally finger? I'm touching it I'm eating it. <laughs> okay, so here we have this like rubbery weird looking, ooh, you can even see the little skinny flesh thingies. Oh my gosh, it's gross. Is that hair? <laughs> it is hair. Oh. Guys, I don't know if you can appreciate that. Can you see that? I don't know if I can see the hair. Uh, there's texture for sure. And you can even see the follicles of the cuticle, like the little bumps, the chicken skin, but it's pig's feet. It's pigs. Okay, so we're gonna fry it on the pan and just like it's cook it up. Okay, right. it's been uh, frying. It's got all those marks on the pan. I just wanna show you guys. Maybe you didn't appreciate the hair beforehand. Oh, 
<laughs> that stinks so bad. I don't know if you can see this. Like, see if I can I'm just saying. Or maybe against the black of the it just, microwave. <laughs> can it you just see smells like vinegar. I think you can. Yeah. <laughs> You can see the hair. Oh, yeah. Guys, look at it. Like, you know. It reeks really bad. <laughs> We're going to try this, guys, and that maybe it's reeks. better. How will we know unless we try it? We're going to take so, your word for it. Okay. Oh. oh, it's really strong vinegary. It like went up my nose. That's why I had to pull away. It's because I almost like started like coughing from the good sign. Oh. Let me guess. Tastes like bacon? Is it good? What? No. Try, try a piece. No. I, mean, I still love it vinegary, but it's more bacon than it is the. What? It's vinegar. It's like vinegar bacon. Have we been eating this wrong the whole time? Maybe we have. Can I just show you? Just put it by your nose. You're not gonna eat it. Do you see what I'm saying? It, the vinegar goes up your nose. It almost burns your sinuses. Oh. Guys, this is much. Much better. Like I can actually eat it and swallow it. Oh, hair and all. If I had to, I'm not gonna lie. If I was out of food and needed to eat this, I would eat it cooked. I could not get it down raw. I would just, I couldn't. Yeah, raw. But cooked, tough. you could actually live on this. Oh my goodness. You might even like it because you like vinegary pickled We're things. We're gonna have to call Audrey. Oh, this is killer. amazing. She's been eating it wrong this whole time. Insane. Cooked is much better. It really is. Does it taste good you know, though? We never like it's bottle. not bad. Maybe you're supposed it's to cook it. It's not bad. You know, we have never read we've the bottle. We've never read the bottle. Maybe we've been eating it raw and we're not supposed to be. I, I think when I read the reviews, they said to just eat it because it's cured. It's cured. Like you just uh, eat you it. So you can, yeah. Yeah, and people say like on the reviews <laughs> of this that they just eat it out of the jar and they like it. <laughs> It's not good out of the jar. It's really, really bad. If you don't believe me, you just need to go get a jar yourself and try it. But this is not bad. This is an improvement. We will not use cooked pig's feet in our punishments because it's actually okay. <laughs> we want to thank you all for submitting your things that you wanted us to say yes to. I know we didn't get to a lot of yours and a lot we may have skipped on shouting out, even if you suggested some of the things we did. We appreciate you anyways. And we hope that next time we do another challenge that we can get to yours. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Oh, it's flashing. It literally is flashing. Oh, yeah, they probably spotted us. How did they get there? The landscape has changed. This is crazy. What? I don't know if you can see it. It's like a crater. Look. Oh my goodness. Okay, something dented. We're in the crater. Right by it. You can see all the... I don't know if you can see it on camera. Dad, I found something! What? What? Right there, look! What is it, Ty? What is that? Whoa. I'm afraid to touch it. Oh, it's so nasty. Here, it's a box. The I don't know what this is, but some part of some... something. like the top portion. You are kidding me. Evidence Look at that. number two. We this? think that says millimeters and not centimeters. Huh. Oh, that oh, does. Yes. It keeps jumping on the charts. Oh. 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 oh! Okay, we have got our items from the crash site and we're about to examine them. However, if you're going to be handling this stuff, you need to suit up, get gloves on because you shouldn't be touching this stuff without until we've tested it and we're aware whether it's safe or not safe. And guys, if you've been watching and keeping up with all the videos in between this series, between like the first of the series and like right now, you know that we've been finding different things and we've been updating you guys in these other videos that we've been doing. So if you haven't checked those out, make sure you do check them out because we found some other stuff and we're just gonna elaborate more and okay. check it out. We're gonna do video. some tests. We have found right? some things yeah. that are just not coincidental. These are legit. Like this is crazy. Like this it's is for real. Yeah. We're thinking it's towards, can I just say, towards, okay. Okay. We're thinking that this is a legit alien cover-up. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I went back this morning to take some footage and one, I forgot my camera so I couldn't take pictures, but I'll go back again, but it's all covered up now. All that you saw in that previous video, the dirt and mound and everything. How did they get there? The landscape has changed. This is crazy. What? Check this out. I don't know if you can see it. It's like a crater. Look. Right there. Oh. 
Oh my goodness. Okay, what something dented the earth there. That was not all dug out before. It's all covered it's up. Gone, like, it's all gone. Spit. It's it's all been it's taken care Guys, of. Guys, isn't it's that crazy. so weird? I'll so take pictures of it and we'll put it in another video in the like future. Two days, yeah. They and there's a whole bunch of everything. new excavating on the other side of the hill. I'll show you pictures of that as well. It is oh. insane. Okay, Jordan, tell them what you found what in yeah. your research. So I've been looking up a lot on the internet. This is gonna blow your mind. Yeah, this is really crazy. I was showing dad this earlier. It's I got really goosebumps, wild. like the hair <laughs> on my arms started raising up. Yeah, we found some serious discoveries. So since we started to believe that this was like an alien cover up because literally like it seems like a lot of evidence points to that, I've been looking up like UFO crashes and different things about aliens. And UFO just, wreckage. Yeah, just like everything about that. And so I have some images that I'm going to show you guys that I printed out because I thought it was kind of crazy. And it's um, going to blow your mind. This is really wild. So here's a picture that, that, like, okay, so this stuff isn't just happening in our area. Apparently it's also happening in, like, in other parts of the world. And so this is, like, what I'm showing you. This yeah. picture, all these pictures she's going to show you came from Roswell, New Mexico. Better known as Area, area 51. 51. Area 51. Area 51. So, oh my um, gosh, that's just like that yeah, the like clouds. The cloud we saw? Yeah. I was gonna say our clouds aren't it exact. It wasn't exactly funnel, but we had a funnel like the top portion. Yeah, above the mountain. Yeah, There's right. a column getting ready to go over it. And it looks so this is gonna like be crazy. Cloud. Interesting. Yeah. Above the mountain. When I saw that, I was like, oh my goodness. And so they said this cloud formation suddenly appeared. Strange things happened, and when the things were over. The clouds were gone. And Did that not happen with us? us? Whoa, wait, guys, that cloud's gone. Oh my god. What? I just noticed it. Where'd it go? That yeah, literally, wow. yeah. Yes. That is crazy. Yeah. So I wanted to print it out because I thought that was very wild that, like, the, we, we had noticed cloud the formation cloud too. It was yes. kind of like a wow. funnel. Yes. I'll get ready for this next so picture. So, also, oh. you guys know that streak of light that we saw? Yeah. You are kidding me. Evidence Look at that. number two. Oh my goodness. Guys, I hope that got on camera. Did you see that? Look at that. Whoa. This is not like from our recordings. This is from Another Area 51. One. Area 51, Roswell. Like, <laughs> that is not a coincidence. That looks so similar. Okay, do you see how this is piling up, Jake and Ty? Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is crazy, right? Okay, get ready. They found wreckage. So they found a lot more wreckage than we did, but this yeah. is a picture of some of the wreckage that they found. Which is not identical to ours. Yeah, you can but just see. gives you an idea of looking at the material of what it was. Wait till you see what we found. Yeah, I was gonna say that looks. So that crazy. looks. So they found. That looks like it could be part of like say this, right? And so I've washed this up a lot, and it's. It, it like chips the away too. The metal detector. So I put Jake and Ty's metal detector over this, and it doesn't detect this yeah. as metal. But it feels like metal, it's hard like metal. It's got a functioning button, well it's not functioning anymore, but it has a button here. Yeah. I don't know what it was, but check this next picture So out. we don't know yeah. what type of metal I have not metal that is. It's, it's a non-metal, metal looking object. Or maybe it's metal, but something our detectors don't, can't detect. I'm yeah. thinking this That's is That's why I'm thinking, because I'm like, a metal detector won't pick it up, but it like feels like heavy and like yeah. metal. It's not, it's, it doesn't, check it's not like really plastic. Close, like, like the parts here weird, where it's right? darker, I couldn't get to scrub off, but pieces of it, look, pieces, oh, where'd it go? It can like chip off. No, it right does. there, it's chipped right yeah, there. Yeah, chips off. I don't want to touch it, but. Yeah, yeah. but it's, it's definitely like heavy. Yeah. But check out this picture. This is gonna blow your mind. Yeah, here's the last one. Um, I'm just saying, does that not look that very right similar? Or kind of yeah. even like the green thing, but maybe not. Yeah, it kind of looks I like think the green this, thing, but not. I think this, obviously, I, I'm gonna rule this out. This is just plastic garbage. You think this, so? This, yes. This you don't think that garbage. you think that was there before? I the think crash? That it just happened to be there, and we just found some garbage, but we found other things that are not. Yeah, so that, that just looks very like 
if I turn the angle like this, it kind of looks almost like that piece. Kind of looks similar. I mean, obviously it's different breakage and like everything. It's different. It's a different part. But this could but like be the, the other side of that. I'm like, you could see the sizing. That looks pretty. Like I don't know. Because that's in millimeters, yeah. not inches. Yeah. That looks pretty similar. If we get a millimeter, it's almost the same size. I have a ruler. Why don't you boys run downstairs on the Lego table and grab that yardstick? Let's okay. measure yeah. and see if this measures up in millimeters. If it's the same size, that will be. I will scream yeah so <laughs> i've heard <laughs> so yeah wow. those were some of the, just a few of the images guys i've literally been like researching this like crazy like i've stayed up late at night like reading articles and everything and i found some other stuff too this did was just like the most notable like, disappearances did they have we, like we haven't gotten that far yet. yeah mm -hmm. i haven't been we just got to the wreckage what happened yeah. so we were researching what happened before the alien wreckage what happened during and after before during after. And was there a cover up with this? Oh, absolutely. If you if you put in Roswell, New Mexico, there's cover ups everywhere. Cover ups everywhere. Oh yeah, everywhere. we had to search a Conspiracy lot. Conspiracy theories. You can't even count how many there are. There's pages and pages. You guys ready? Wait, I need this, some gloves. I haven't done enough research on what this is. I just cleaned it up. I don't um, think it's bone. It is porous though. Also, we're using gloves because I mean we did touch it to pick it up first, but we don't want to get any more of like our DNA or anything on it because right. when we're like looking or at it and contaminants, or like, contaminants. I want to make sure it's safe. Yeah. Yeah. That and we don't have to it over. We're but if we're perform some tests on it too. I was gonna say, if we're gonna test it, we don't wanna put a bunch of our DNA and like cover up other no, stuff. No, it's so. true. We need to keep it as clean as yeah. possible. Okay. Yeah. This is okay. very wild. So, so, what I wanted to do today was one, show you guys this evidence that we're finding that this is this is too coincidental. But two, I wanna. Jake found this, or he took this dirt sample. Remember when he was in his hazmat suit? Soil sample, yeah. Yeah, the soil sample. I wanna see what's in here. And then, I'm gonna have to do this on another video. Let's figure out what this box is. Yeah, and and I was gonna ask it's you, warm Jordan. Too, by when, in your research, did you find anywhere where it talked about strange writings? Was there anything reports of writings of anything? I've got a report on there that. There wasn't tons, but there was some. But it's like it's hard to find. Like because most of the stuff is covered up. It takes so much. There research. were a few things that we found that when we went back to print it, it wouldn't let us print it. Yeah. This is document That's, not printable. Yeah. So. That's weird. Yeah. Well, yeah. it's not a ruler, but it has. Centimeters here. Okay. We need millimeters. Centimeters and millimeters. So, so we're it's two and a half inches long. What's the conversion? All right, guys. So our thing is about like two inches. We've remeasured and I lined it up exactly. It's about two inches. So we're converting it. Yeah. So it's about sixty-three point five centimeters or millimeters. Millimeters. Which is crazy because we this... think that says millimeters and not centimeters. But so... if it's centimeters, it's about s almost seven. Which would Which be like exact. Close, but this is like nine. Well, but they no, did start right here. They start at one. And you cut out. Push it over an inch. Yeah. So if it is it's centimeters, close. then it's very close. But, but if not, our sample is much much larger, which means we have yeah. a better sample yeah. than I, what they collected. I was gonna say, which means our area is probably way more like, I don't know, more of a hot spot. Well, we got there immediately after it happened. All right, so we want to do a couple of tests. Yeah. So we've got the tools that Jake had. Remember when he was using this, he pushed the button in, okay, so it's saying it's ready. And when he got to the dirt sample, it lit up. Let's we'll see if it still does. See, right when I go on it, there's something. We do Something it around like all this other stuff to okay. see if it goes no, up a does. little bit, but not much. <gasps> that oh does. Okay, so I say we test some of the soil first. Okay. Yeah. I think that we should find out about what's around the soil. Right now it says the temperature okay. through the glass is about 72 degrees. Yeah, this shines a laser. I don't know if you guys can tell. So look, so you can see the laser on the on the table. Yeah. If I shine it through the glass, it's 72 degrees. We'll yeah. see if that changes when we get it out. All right, Jake, are you ready? Yeah. So let's first so, test to see if anything UV light, if anything reacts. So turn those UV lights on. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna pour a little bit out. That might be what what's like setting even. it off. That could be what's setting it off. Well, I don't know what's got like. These there might be stuff things. in that. <gasps> There's like little pieces and stuff. Do you see that? This yeah, dirt is like shiny. Out. Okay, look at it through the light. Anything? I'm not seeing anything. I'm gonna close this back. I mean, up. there's like little specks that light up. Wait, can we flip off the lights? Yeah, let's turn off the light. I don't know if that will help at all. 
There's like some little things that glow up. I hear it looks like it glows a bitty. tiny bit, but I like, you if we see that put green thing? Shiny yeah. things in it. That's what you were talking about Look. when it was shiny. Yeah, I was it's gonna shiny. say when I was walking around there, I was like, guys, the dirt is shiny from certain angles. That's why. Like, that's yeah, why, because we're literally. seeing some little shiny bits in there. Literally, yeah, oh. it's so true. There's another there's one, stuff. Dad. Yeah, do you see that? That's crazy. I see like a purple oh, thing reflecting. Dude, there's a whole what bunch of those? things. I don't know. They're throughout oh, the soil. Look. Oh, they're there's all so throughout the soil. I didn't even realize there's okay. Is this one? I think there's one in here. Oh, how'd you see it? I saw it with the light. It was reflecting in my eye. Okay. That is so interesting. All right, that's what we can kind of see with our eyes. But I read that because remember you did your your uh, your EMF reader. Watch yeah. this. So electromagnetic activity takes place with this. So watch. It keeps jumping on the charts. Let me go close to these. Guys, this is an EMF reader. Yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so there's something with this, there's but we can't necessarily see it. putting off stuff into the air. Yeah, isn't that like, is that like radiation stuff? Because doesn't it pick up that stuff? Because this will go off like if you're running a microwave and you just put it yeah. close to usually it. Usually electronics. That's high rates. Yeah, usually electronics um, do that. So it's weird that a soil sample would have those read off like I was, that. yeah, I was going to say, we should grab some normal dirt from like our front porch or something, like well, from our garden, yeah. and huh? show the difference. Ty, can you go grab a handful of dirt off Because us? that should not be happening. This is showing like serious like energy that's radiating. Like that's really Yeah, there's really some kind of crazy. energy or waves or something being okay. put off from that soil sample. So another thing I was reading that you can test the soil to see that we can't see with our eyes is to run magnets over them because to see if there's anything in there that could be a foreign material is what I was told. So if you want to take that magnet yeah, and swish so we it got in there. This magnet right here. Yeah, we ordered these bar magnets. Yeah. And these are supposed to pick up really small particles as well as big particles. Yeah. Um, yeah. Anything that could be metallic or uh, anything. So that we're could testing the soil to see if it's metallic. It doesn't matter which side. Is the soil metallic? So okay. you guys can Do test. Do it with the red side. Oh! So. Oh! oh. Oh, wait. wow. Okay, can you brush that off and let's do that again? Brush so it off over see. here though. Let's, let's have it fall into here. Okay, and the other dirt that just came in is dirt from our front okay. yard. Okay. Yeah, so, so this let is, me check the EMF on this. This is the front yard. You can already tell the texture. This has a little bit more like sticks and stuff in it. And also the color looks different to me It's very least. different, very different texture. No reading. Yeah, that's nothing. literally doing nothing. And then go back over here. Okay, let me clear it out so it's clear. And it's lighting up. Lighting. Yeah, so there's an okay. obvious difference. You should test this one and see if there's any metal in here, Jake. Switch I'm not getting anything. This. Okay, okay. So now we're going back to this one. Go back to this one. Okay, use the red side. Use the red side. It'll be easier for the camera to see if there's more okay. in there. I can't believe that you actually picked up stuff. Just run it all Oh my goodness! Whoa, that's a lot! Dude. This is just by touching it. Dirt is sticking to that. Oh, Let me see if I can get try more. Try this one again with yours. Yeah, Let's I'll try because this one's clean. It has nothing on it. Whoa! I just touched it again. So we definitely have oh. some magnetic properties in the soil sample. Jordan, how about yours? I'm getting really into this. Like I'm putting it in the dirt, trying to really like make sure. Yeah, I'm gonna skip this else. out. Right? Wait, show, the show the difference. Show the difference. Show the difference. Okay, so that's a huge difference. As you can see, this one right here has a lot more yeah. than the other. The soil sample has more than the soil sample from our house. That is crazy. Try this real fast. So Try definitely see. there's some magnetic properties. There's some shiny. There's some uh, <gasps> oh. waves. Oh. oh. And you can like shake it. Oh. Look at that. Oh, oh, oh it's spiky. It is spiky. Yeah, why is that going spiky? Oh my why goodness. Why is the dirt spiking out? I'm dropping all the regular dirt out. Oh my goodness. And it's leaving whatever this is behind. Guys, something definitely happened in that area. This is, th there's too much evidence. There's too yeah. much evidence. That means it's evidence of a crash site because otherwise, Literally. why would it be like that? Look oh at this. my definitely goodness. There's definitely some spiky stuff going on. And like, is that stuff from our world? Cause wow, dirt from like, our front porch is not like that. Okay, so I think that before we get ahead of ourselves, because we're collecting so much information, I think it's important that we start writing down everything that we've learned about this crash site, and we're going to make a file of it. So this will be file one, and this is all our evidence that we're grabbing. We're starting to get it written down before we continue on with more testing. EMF level five. Yes. So that's the highest that this will record, which is crazy. Do you want to write on there soil sample one? Because what if we come across other evidence things? I'll color code it. We'll make yeah. this like a, a 
blue. This is insane! Weird. Very wild. What did we find? I don't know. We're gonna regroup. We're gonna um, come back. That's it for today. We're going to uh, kind of figure out and make sure we've got all this evidence like filed away properly before we continue on because this is more evidence than we were expecting. But anyway, if you guys collect any evidence of your own and if you have any stories or any proof of any type of aliens, if you've seen any sightings, then let us know as well and we'll compare our evidence and maybe we can come up with something. Yeah. But yeah. Because I think we need to bust this wide open and get the truth out there. The truth is out there. Alrighty guys, we are back. Um, we've collected our thoughts some more and gathered some more information and we're gonna start doing some other tests. So I'm gonna show you our setup that we have going on over there, but also we need to take the proper precautions. And so I'm going to be wearing this face shield just in case. And the boys have safety glasses and we got gloves and everything. We're just getting all ready for all of these tests. So let me show you what's going on. Everyone's over here. Um, we're all looking at some different things. Did you see that? Whoa, there's a big chunk right there. Yeah. Did you see that? Yeah. Do you see that big metal chunk? Yeah, so they're all looking at that wow. stuff. Dad has been researching a bit. Whoa. We're gonna do some, Oops. we have these little strips over here that we're gonna test if it's acidic or basic, which is like the chemical composition of um, whatever we're testing. We're gonna test the soil, right? Did the the, yeah. the yeah. acidity and the alkalinity. It's kind of like glue. Okay, so I'm gonna stay back and let you guys do the testing. I'll take the camera. That's why I don't have the shield on is because I'm not gonna be handling that. Yeah. So I need to put you guys on. keep all your okay. protection right. on. We're going to find out I'm gonna some the chemical about. properties of this. Yeah. Okay, so first thing, Jake, if you wanna start up the, the burner. Okay. So we've, so we've got a little chemistry set here. Uh, Jake took chemistry this year. So this is one of the, uh, this is an alcohol burner. You put in a certain type of alcohol in here and it burns clean. And then we put in, the water is actually not just tap water, it's distilled water, yeah. <laughs> distilled water, which means it takes out all the minerals. And so what we're trying to find out is, is this, this foreign substance that keeps sticking to these magnets, is this gonna cause the water to turn an alkaline, like a base, or is it gonna cause it to turn acidity, like an acid? Yeah, so we have our control environment, and we're gonna see. And if you guys are just joining in, this is the first time you've seen or heard of this, What's going on is that we witnessed a something crash from the sky. We went to the crash site. We collected some soil samples as well as found some other artifacts. Let's yeah. call it what it is. We found a UFO. We that's what we believe. We believe yeah. we are conducting an alien investigation UFO sighting and we have evidence. We're trying to collect more evidence. So now we're doing some other properties of this soil sample that we previously collected. Yeah, and for all of you guys who are in chemistry or who are like super into science or if you have any like parents that know about this stuff and you have any other information, let us know. Um, do not do this at home though. Yeah, do, do not, not do try this at home. home. This do is, not try this at home. We're dealing with a substance here that's unknown. Plus we're also dealing with heat. So just watch us, don't do it at home. Okay, so okay. first step, you're heating that up so and then we're going to I'm first going to take, sample. this is a, this is a, um, what's it called, a stir. Mm -hmm. but I'm going to put a, some water on it and I'm going to put it on the blue, which is going to tell us if it's alkaline. Uh, so he's talking about the blue paper so that we can have a controlled paper so we know what to compare it to. So that's like normal. Yeah. And then whatever we put on here will be the other okay. test and we'll find out if there's any change. Yeah. If that would have turned red, that would have meant that there's acid in the water. And there's no acid and it's in no, the water. It's not red at all. Right yep. now. It looks totally fine. Let's see what the red does. The red should stay red. So you're putting on the red paper this time. Yeah. And this will do... And it should not change color. If it does change color, then it's an alkaline. Okay, okay so we're in a neutral environment right now. Yeah, they look pretty neutral. I don't think they've changed color. Yeah. So now I'm going to mix in Ooh, some of this... Lava. That is crazy. Our this weird substance dirt. that we found. It's like... Okay, our soil sample crazy. is now going in. Oh my goodness. To the container. Oh! Oh! It just like dissolved. Do you see how fast it just like dissipated? Wow. Yeah. It is like like the water so isn't even really murky or anything. Doesn't. Yeah, that did that soil did not like, dirty the water. That it is stayed so very weird. Clear. You would think that the very water would clear. get all dirty. Yeah. The soil still looks like, very clean. And did you see those metal uh or whatever these Weird ball, ball things. Yeah, we don't know what like they, it just sunk immediately. Like it yeah. went d and made a ding sound. And, and we found. Burner, Jake. Just so you yeah. guys know, we found 13 of them. 
13? There's 13? There's 13. So that's, 13? I think that's a clue. That's like kind of a lucky, yeah. right? Lucky or unlucky? Isn't 13 like an unlucky? Here, How weird is that 13. that we found 13? What? Okay. Okay. So Let 13 me. of these little round, um, I mean, they're just little round balls, so. The flame is at 188 degrees. That's the flame. 188? 188. Now the water is 130 degrees right now. So let's give it just a minute. I would like to get it to where it's almost boiling, but not boiling, because I don't want the I don't want the composition of the water to go from a liquid to a vapor. I yeah, like to keep it still it in. in. That is so odd that like that is like that's seriously. I mean, it's yeah. clear, but the dirt's all laying mm. on the bottom with the bubbles. Even when you stir it, it's not. It doesn't up even dirt. move. It's yeah, like, why is it not it's like picking up dirt? Days. We're at 155 yeah, really degrees. Strange. Look at this. I I don't know if you can see it on camera, but when I move it around. It just makes patterns. Yeah. Like whatever pattern I'm moving, that's the Which pattern that it keeps. Also, could oh. that kind of explain like the crop, crop circles? Crop circles. Crop circles. <gasps> Is this one one of the properties that explains that? Because that's related to aliens. What? Maybe. That could very well. This, this might be. A we might have that, found something that the scientists don't even know. I was gonna say, and I don't know if this is like from our earth because this is not in our normal dirt like this might have been from like whatever planet i don't even know that is so That's strange really okay guys it's hit 200 degrees now 212 is when the water will boil so i don't want it to get any hotter but look the bubbles are starting to go up the sides and it's actually getting an yeah, opaque the color are going yeah up the like side the color is changing the water is changing so there's yeah. been a chemical reaction jake do you want to snuff out the flame. Yeah. Let's turn that off. Okay. So go ahead and snuff that out. Now let's stir this up a little bit. I can't really see in there anymore because it's gotten. Uh, yeah, it's so murky now. Yeah. So something, we're gonna, something happened. So. We're gonna test it out now. This is definitely a chemical reaction happened. Okay, so we have our control paper, <gasps> and we have oh. our other. It turned red. That's a very it's a different. Oh my. Oh. oh my goodness. Okay, so that's not the same as our control paper. This is our control. So. That would make sense that that doesn't turn blue. Because it's we went from. What does that mean? We went to an acidic, because that would have turned blue if it was alkaline. Our test was base. There was nothing in it. It was. It was there's no alkaline it was or neutral. base. It was neutral. So this that one's heating very it up different. turned it to a an acidic base. So yeah. whatever metal or whatever this is, it's, it's got an acidic oil. property to it. Yep. The soil is acidic, huh. so we need to write that down. Acidic soil. Right here. The soil. Maybe the soil is only acidic. Underline it with the water. Put positive or something like that. So we also took that chunk. Remember that chunk of stuff that Jake had? Yeah. And we we sliced it. I have a, a rock uh, slice or a rock. What is it called? A pile saw. Okay. And sliced a very very thin slice. Jordan's got it under the microscope here. Right here. I'm you're not gonna believe what you're gonna see here. So I can take this off because we're not dealing with the heat anymore. Let me get my phone over it. Keep your gloves if you're touching samples, though. Uh, so got... I'll keep one glove on. Because <laughs> I gotta use my phone so you guys can see this. We, I think we've discovered something that other scientists have. One, this, oh, which could explain is. crop circles. Whatever's in here, when it lays down on vegetation, I bet it kills it and it forms a, a formation of whatever they sprayed it on. Because notice, when we went and found this, what did the ground look like? There was no vegetation at all. Nothing was there. It was yeah. destroyed. It's Gone. Just, it was just dark. So I wonder if things can live in this. Oh, wow. Let's find it. Look at that. Okay. That is insane. It is like. All right, come over here. Come it is my like shoulder. purple. So you know this is not trickery. We're going to. This is my camera. You can see my, my camera. Now I'm going to put the lens over the microscope so you can see it. Whoa. Right there. What is that? I don't know. I don't know, but there's a lot of divisions and it's very purplish in that. color. Yeah. That right there. Right there. Look at that. That's the Okay. That's that's from these this whatever this stuff that we found which, on I can't touch it. Is well, making, it's this it's this stuff right here. Which is making soil, me think it's like, in the soil sample. But like, we found another piece. Where did the other slide go, Jordan? Like it's making me think like what if that's like a DNA part from the not yeah, that seems really weird. Because yeah. there is because I remember studying and using a microscope studying like plant cells and animal cells, and you can definitely tell that these have cells in them. So, it's so you think like, it's like I that's, think we might have what is that it. like biological? So something's mixed in. It could like, be alive. Those look like cells. 
Or this, like could, this could be, be bacteria alive. in the dirt. You I think this be... is alive, then we need to get that contained because... Or it could be it just starts lot... walking away. What if that starts uh, growing or is, yeah, something happens? It could be multiplying, it could get worse. I was going to say... Take over. I You're think right, we probably better it could be this. bacteria that's not from this planet. Yeah, and what if it starts growing and spreads and then all of a sudden it's all over our house and we've unleashed something. You know what? Let's that's do this. I'm going to pull some of it out of here. Let me get it set up. We'll come right back. Let me get it set up. We're going to have to probably dispose of, here. of that. Yeah. That can't go down the drain. I'm going to take... Yeah. Look, I'm going to take an eyedropper, okay? I'm going to pull some of that out. We're going to put it on a, on a slide and yeah, let's see what it looks like one. after it's been heated up. Yeah. Okay. okay. And we can see it before and after. Okay, so let's grab our sample of the stuff inside. Yeah. It's kind of okay. foamy on top now that you've yeah, got Yeah, there's stuff yeah. on there. That's weird. Okay. She's going to put it on a slide. Rest it back in there so it doesn't get okay. too lost. We're using a different scope? No, gauge. Oh yeah, scope. Yeah, so you can see it, and then once you see it, then we'll switch it to a higher power. Yeah, and also we don't want to touch the stuff, so. This I'm excited to see, to see if it changed properties. Because the water changed properties. It went from a, a <gasps> What? What? Oh. Is it kind of the same? Now. No, you no. gotta adjust it just a little bit. Dude, dude. Don't move it, just adjust it. Dude, that was <gasps> creepy. She freaked out. Does it look different? Oh yeah. So by heating it, okay, it heating did it, something? It changed the property, changed the to acidic, but let's see what it changed the hmm. microscopic look to. Guys, I just want you to check out that one because wow. Okay. Oh my here goodness, we go. guys, this is really, really crazy. You gotta get it. I don't think you're gonna believe it. Whoa. What? Wait, wait. What is, is that? that it? That's not like the last thing. Wait, it's nothing like the last thing. Zoom in. Uh, zoom in. Do you see the details? Here, let me get a higher power. That That's, looks a little sus. That? I don't that know. Twig? Let me get a higher power because you're on the low power right now. Guys, what? Oh! Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, this is a higher power. I think we might have found something. Oh. <gasps> Ew. Oh. What is that? You. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's not a stick. Let me see if I can get uh -uh. even higher power. That, that looks, looks like a leg or something. There's like hairs and there's yeah. like a claw yeah. on so it. So you think something, looking. like it's a claw, like it's starting to grow? Or leg. It just looks very scary. I have no idea what that is. <gasps> How are we going to dispose of this then? Guys, we Whoa. can't have those things growing in our house. If I you hope unleash they don't grow. something. <gasps> oh no. <my> <gasps> what? Okay, <gasps> this is the highest this goes. This is the highest magnification. <laughs> My eyes! I can't believe what I just saw. Look at this. Okay, everybody looking at the phone? Okay, and there it is. Ew! <gasps> is that like a worm? Or I don't know what something? that is. What is that? Oh. Is that like a needle in the middle? Okay. That was creepy, guys. Let me take a picture of it. That was no like twig. That was not a leg. It could be a claw. It could be an entire like creature that is now forming. There's a bunch of those in there. I'm yeah, wondering. I think we need to get this stuff locked up. Yeah, Let's I clean up this area. Uh, I, I don't know. Gravity. Like, I feel like our containment is not up to par for what we're now dealing with. I think whatever is in there, when we boiled it or got it close to boiling, it hatched. hatched it. Oh. Something hatched. <laughs> Wait, maybe what if those thirteen are... things. What if they're things maybe. that hatch? Those marbles, those say, round things. Those little cells. Maybe those were eggs, and then the heat just hatched them. So do you think whatever that is, it's a protective coating that we just guys? We might have unleashed something. Can we like just clean this up and contain it? Okay. I think we need to get this all put away in a safe. Yeah, guys, lock it up. Yeah. Here, pause it here. Okay, so we've moved to the basement because we're going to set up and organize our board. We're putting it caution. Yes. Um, this is all our evidence board. Basically, anything yeah. that we found in case file, whatever this investigation is, one, yeah. we're naming it file one. It's going on this board. We'll this collect way, the evidence. Yeah, this way we just have everything laid out and nice and easy for us to see. And I really don't want to forget about any of it. So we're just going to put it all up here and maybe it will help us like see other things too. So like, start yeah. taping up what we've, if we've collected. Matched that maybe we can connect the dots. <laughs> well, that's what we need to do. We need to connect what piece goes with what piece. And so let's start taping them up, boys. Can you go grab the tape? Yeah. Right there and we'll hang them up. So we first have the piece of evidence that matches ours, right? So we're going to put that as like, so what are some of the properties? And we could even have like strings maybe going down to that evidence. Cause like, we know from this evidence here, that came from the soil. You could even draw a string to some of those properties that we tested, like it's acidic. Okay, so underneath that, we should probably like, we so need the properties string. Of the things. So we found it. Yeah. And 
Should we can drag string to each of the things, yeah, or just however. It doesn't matter where. I think as long as we got connection to it. UV light. Let me get the string. Yeah, as long as the string can go to the things, and then if it connects to anything else, like was the UV light connected to the funnel cloud? Like we want to connect what piece went to what, and then if we find any new evidence, does the UV light go to a new piece of evidence? Yeah. Do you see what I'm saying? So then yeah. you draw a string from each piece that you find and so, see if it's the same. I took our evidence sample and I sealed it. I put all this stuff back in here. I, I drained the water out and I flushed it down and I throw it really good. No, <laughs> it's, good. no so all, all the metal stuff, else. all those, whatever the stuff is here, but the liquid. But what if there was like a little um, You're gonna hatch things in the water? No, I you dumped it. You, what if you unleashed something and now we have stuff that starts swarming? Ah. We told you that this it's had to be in, handled properly. It's all in okay, here. you know what, guys? Right now, I think that anytime we have to clean up an area, let's leave David out of it. He cannot be responsible of that containment because he's probably going to unleash things upon us and upon you. No, I'm not. I'm not. I've got it all Dude, in here. It's sure. Uh huh. Okay. I think that we'll take care of it from now on. All right. I hope we don't start having crawly things all over. I swear, if things start emerging from wherever, like, what if that water goes to like people's lawns and then all these things start emerging from people's yeah. lawns? <laughs> David. If David. Okay. If crop circles start showing up around here, I will take the blame for it. <laughs> I will go on the TV and I will say, I flushed the little alien things down the toilet. Okay, the board's coming together. We just need to keep placing whatever evidence there is yeah. up there. So we know that like this funnel cloud was from area 51 and we believe that it might have those properties that were alive that was connected to our fragment. Now this came from Area 51, but it's very similar to our soil fragments that we were testing. Yeah. So the stuff that we were testing had these contain these uh, properties. And so we're just trying to make a connection between anything we gather. And so that's what the strings run along is trying to make those connections. Yeah. Yeah. I have a feeling we're going to use up this entire too. wall. <laughs> Probably. So I've been doing some more research. So there's some other things that we can put on here or maybe we put them on as we find stuff out. But one thing I did is I went on and I looked at where are they seeing alien or UFOs and all these dots are where they've seen them this year in just the United States. So you can see there's dots all over the map. There's one right there where we were. So I zoomed in on it a little further. I don't know if you can see it here. <laughs> this is crazy. I don't think you can see it any better. But this is, is this is an interactive map of UFO sight, sightings taken seriously by the US government. So this is from the US government's page where they're they're admitting that this is actually taking place. A couple things I was thinking, okay, if this is what it is. If this evidence leads to what? What's next? How do we communicate with them? Do you guys want to communicate with aliens? Should we try to figure out how to communicate with them? Because maybe we found a way to grow an alien. I don't know. <laughs> we don't know what's yeah, going on. So grow safe. your Let's own alien. So, yeah, grow your own alien. I found this article. It's like sea monkeys, but not. <laughs> this article, Soil sample. We'll if you look it. up here, it says for official use has been crossed out. This used to be classified material from the US government on how to communicate with extraterrestrial intelligence, aliens. There's a whole like 15 pages. So I'm gonna put maybe one on here so we can just show how it has writings. And I think when we get to the box and start looking at the box, we'll get more into this on how to figure out how to communicate with them. But then I also started thinking, okay, well, are there pictures of aliens? So like, there's like Hollywood's picture, right? But a lot of people describe them with big eyes. And a little it's got chin. The creepy hair things like that was on our sample. Yeah, that's gross. That's why yeah. I printed this one off. That's Cause gross. Cause I'm like, cause I've seen like in movies and stuff where they've depicted aliens like yeah. they can climb walls. Well, now that we saw that under the microscope, you can see how they'd be able to climb and stick things and do different things. Mm -hmm. But this was taken in Russia of an alien from a UFO crash. Like an alien or a the... This is the actual alien. So you can like... see there's the eye and there's the mouth. Oh my this is his head. Huh. Like the alien. It, it's deceased. This one is deceased. Okay. But this was like, found it looks at like the it's crash. In snow or like. But if that's the case, it. there's probably aliens among us that are alive. Wow. 
wow. around us. So I'm thinking that this is maybe crazy guys. Yeah, a lot. We put that what up if here. That's what we were seeing the beginnings of. Are they alive? Are they here? How can we get them to come see us, right? So there was, a, so no. I, I Googled, I don't how can see we- see us, but I want more evidence. I know, I, I, yeah. I, just, well, I did Google, Nervous. how can we communicate with aliens and how can we get aliens to come to us? And this is, this is from the Munchies website. It says, this alien expert says eating vegan food is best to attract sky beings. Maybe we should okay. try it. I don't know, maybe we should try it. I don't know, vegan food. And then how can we communicate with them? Lasers. So we need to go buy some lasers and start communicating with What's aliens. I think this lasers? is another thing we got to do at nighttime. We'll start okay. sending lasers and start well, communicating. I mean, you have to be careful with doing lasers in the sky because you can't interfere with government airplanes and right. stuff. I was going to say, you so, don't want um, to accidentally use, the, like, you got to be very, very careful with I lasers. I don't know if so. I like that idea. We're yeah. going to get in trouble. Right. Yeah. Maybe we'll I do probably it. not do the lasers. Yeah. I think that you will have a visit from another kind called um, government <laughs> men in black or something will show up and <laughs> last we see of David. Okay. <laughs> Oh, bye, David. <laughs> so our box is sealed. Scary. I'll put this up here as well. Maybe we put it here. We'll put it, put yeah, it has to, to it. go with this um, piece because we're saying that represents our soil. Yeah. It's kind of the similar. I know that came from Area 51, piece go? <gasps> but it's very similar. So maybe I'll put this on top of it. Dude, what if they want it? With your bare hands. <gasps> I uh, forgot. Dad. Dad. Guys, um, we need help. We can't leave David alone with this stuff. Yes. Or what? Uh, no, we can't even let David around this stuff. <laughs> this is like, ah. Okay, we're gonna go take care of this issue. Um, we've got to scrub, make sure David has scrubbed very well, and also finish this board. Yeah. Um, we'll come back another day. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.